What's up, bud? It's Rob. This is Apparel Success, and I'm about to make a bold claim, which is that by the end of this video here, you're going to understand exactly how to market your clothing brand from scratch to getting it to the point where you have dozens of orders coming in on a regular basis. I'm going to show you this step by step here, and I know that there's a scarcity of information online for clothing brand owners out there, so I'm excited to share with you some legitimate information right now. Essentially, every single clothing brand starts from the same place, which is they need to build a foundation for their clothing brand. So the starting point is building a foundation for their brand. And your foundation has four main components. It has a brand concept, your website quality, your product quality, and your social media presentation. Oh. So those are the four main components of your clothing brand when you're first starting out. And if you're just starting out, these are the four parts of your clothing brand that you want to be working on the most. You wanna make sure that your brand concept makes sense and that your brand concept is tight and it's aligned with the audience that you're going after. You wanna make sure that you have a high website quality. You wanna make sure that your product quality is good and you wanna make sure that you're doing your best to present your clothing brand well on social media. Now, all of this alone isn't enough for you to start thriving as a clothing brand. What you need to do next is you need to add value to your clothing brand, okay? So the next step is adding value to your clothing brand. And the way that you do that for a clothing brand is all through the social value. And the reason for that is because as you know, people buying clothing, people don't need to buy clothing as a necessity anymore, they buy it as an accessory. And so basically, the only way you're gonna get people to buy your clothing is if they think it's really cool, and the best way to do that is through adding social value. So the way that we're gonna add social value to your clothing brand is through getting it onto celebrities and influencers and by getting customers. Because when you have customers, that's gonna be social proof for your brand and it's gonna increase the perceived value of your brand. Now let's say you think you have your foundation under control. You have a good brand concept, your website's good, your product quality, and you try to reach out to a bunch of celebrities to get your, your first celebrity endorsements, or you're working Instagram really hard, you're trying to get your first customers, and all this effort that you're putting in isn't working, it's not getting you anywhere. Well, what that signifies is that you need to go back and tweak your foundation and work on your foundation. Because if your foundation's good, if all this is taken care of, you should be able to land some celebrity and influencer endorsements, and you should be able to get some customers for your brand. So you go back, you work on your foundation. When you've done that, you go back here, you try to get celebrities, and you try to get customers. And if that doesn't work again, then you go back, you keep tweaking your foundation, you keep trying, and this is basically an endless cycle until you start to get some celebrity and influencer endorsements. Maybe you get one, maybe you get five, six, ten celebrity endorsements. Maybe you get... 100 customers, 500 customers, 1,000 customers. Well, what happens when you get these customers and ce these celebrity endorsements is now you have data, okay? And what this data allows you to do is it allows you to see exactly who's buying your clothing without any speculation anymore. You have hard data and you know exactly who your customers are and who's willing to actually pull out cash to buy your clothing. And this brings everything back to reality and it gives you some really, really real information for you to use to get to the next step in your clothing brand's life, which is scaling up using that data, okay? And the way that you're gonna scale up is now you can target people way more specifically with Facebook ads, with your advertising, and you can spend your money more wisely, you can spend your time more wisely, and it all contributes to you growing your brand much, much quicker. But until you attain this data right here, it's gonna be very hard for you to scale up and to get any significant results for your clothing brand. So this is the blueprint here and what the journey that you're on looks like growing a clothing brand. And this is a really, really clear perspective of that. And most clothing brands stay in this foundation phase forever. They try to take action. They keep trying to get celebrities to wear their clothing. They keep trying to get customers to buy their clothing, but it just doesn't work. All the efforts that they're putting in it's not working and the issue is that their foundation isn't good enough. And when they're trying to reach out to celebrities, the celebrity's saying, no thanks, you know, this brand doesn't look good enough because of some error in your foundation. And then customers are saying the exact same thing. 
where you're engaging with them on social media, they're checking out your brand and they're saying, eh, I don't want it, the foundation's not very good, okay? So basically, it all starts with the proper foundation and then you work your way to attaining celebrity endorsements, customers for your clothing brand. Once you have customers for your clothing brand, you get data and that data allows you to scale up your clothing brand, know exactly who's buying your clothing brand so that you can target those people exactly and so that you can get amazing results for your brand. Now, my online course, The Clothing Brand Marketing System, shows you how to go in depth into your foundation, into your brand concept, your website, your products, your social media presentation. It shows you how to add value, how to properly reach out to celebrities, how to acquire your customers, and then how to read that data and scale up your clothing brand. So I'm going really, really deep into each and every single one of these stages for growing a clothing brand from scratch. And those are essentially the things that you need to be learning. So if you're interested in that, you can check out my online course. Right now I have an early bird special going on. Um, it's only lasting this week here. And if you're interested, you can head over to clothingbrandmarketing.com to buy that course go through all these different stages in depth, in detail, and master this for your own clothing brand, all right? It was a pleasure showing you that today, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.